Hi everyone, my name is Mike Woolard, and welcome to my course on getting started with OWASP Z Attack Proxy for Web Application Penetration Testing. The Open Web Application Security Project, or OWASP for short, is a free and open community dedicated to securing software. One of the flagship projects is Zap, the Z Attack Proxy. Zap is a tool that can be used by security professionals, developers, and quality assurance teams to test for vulnerabilities in applications under development. Inserting scans with Zap into a SDLC process is the first step towards a stronger and more resilient product. In this course, we're going to cover the interface and understanding how Zap works with the browser, how to prepare your environment as you set up for the attack. We will walk through some of the manual and automated functions of the tool, and finally, how to report on what you found. This course will give you the knowledge to feel confident you will be able to step through an application and find some opportunities to strengthen the security posture of the software. During this course, we are going to talk about some of the more common vulnerabilities found in web applications. A review of the OWASP Top 10 may be beneficial in helping you understand why this tool is able to help you discover the various vulnerabilities. I hope you'll join me on this journey as we start the process to learn how to run your application through a series of tests with the Getting Started with OWASP Z Attack Proxy for Web Application Penetration Testing course here at Pluralsight.